Hi, I am Dr. Guru Prasad Husukar, consultant neurologist at uh, Kolambesha Referral Hospital, Ashwantpur. My special interest is uh, Parkinson disease and movement disorders. DBS, that is DBS, deep brain stimulation surgery in Parkinson disease is a very effective treatment. It usually resolves most of the symptoms of Parkinson disease like tremors, bradykinesia and rigidity. It improves the motor fluctuations. It reduces drug-induced uh, dyskinesias, minimizes the hallucinations and psychosis in the form of reduction in post-op medicine requirement. Usually we target ST and subthalamic nucleus uh, or GPA nucleus in Parkinson's disease. We use high-frequency stimulation, uh, either monopolar or bipolar, using uh, different contacts in ST and nucleus to resolve the, the features of Parkinson's disease. The advantage of DBS as compared to the older generation lesioning is that this is reversible. That means uh, you can reverse the symptoms by adjusting the current. You can uh, program it using external programming devices to control the uh, frequency. You can control the, the contact we are using. You can also control the pulse weight and the type of current, either monopolar or bipolar or sometimes we can use advanced programming in the form of uh, interleaving or MICC to adapt to the changing nature of Parkinson's disease. In effect, DBS is very effective in terms of uh, controlling most of the features of advanced Parkinson's disease and it has become an important tool in terms of uh, therapeutic approaches we have in Parkinson's disease th these days. And uh, nowadays, we are also having a new device which is directional current where you can steer the current in various directions of ST and nucleus to minimize the side effects. We know for sure that DBS also will have some amount of side effects because the STN will carry other networks of behavior or emotional things. So DBS sometimes can cause uh, the side effects. By steering the current to specific direction in STN, we can minimize the side effects. So we have new technologies coming in which are helping us in terms of uh, giving better therapeutic solutions to Parkinson's disease, advanced Parkinson's. We have now battery which can last up to 25 years. Then we don't need to change the battery like we used to do a few years back. So that's an advantage uh, these days in terms of the brain stimulation in, in Parkinson's disease.